Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. My name is Peyton for those of you who don't already know. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys some affordable drugstore makeup products. These products are also, or most of them are also dupes of luxury slash high-end makeup products. So I thought I would just show you guys, you know, a little makeup routine with some cheaper options because I know I show a lot of higher-end or more pricey makeup. So I did just want to show you guys some makeup for those of you who want to get a bang for your buck and you know spend less than four million dollars on makeup so without further ado let's just hop into the video so i went to ulta and i spent a hundred dollars before tax this is my receipt and this is a poor full face so this video will be a full face of makeup for under a hundred dollars yes under a hundred dollars a full face i have primers eyebrow products highlight foundation the whole nine and this is good quality products so before we get into the makeup portion I'm just gonna prep my skin so I'm just gonna take this toner and if you guys hear your crying in the background that's my kitten he's locked in the room because he doesn't know how to act so we're just gonna ignore that we're just gonna prep my skin I have some scarring, which is ugh, the worst, but yeah. So just apply that all over. And then I'm gonna go in with um, this Fenty Skin Hydro Visor. It's a moisturizer with SPF. I'm gonna go in with that and just apply that all over my face as well. And once my face is completely covered with that, I'm gonna go in with this Mario Badescu facial spray. This is the one with aloe herbs and rose water. Okay, so my skin is now prepped, so let's dig into this Ulta bag. And this is what the bag looks like, by the way. So, oh, something in my hair. So we're gonna start out with brows, like we normally do. And for brows, I got the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. It looks like this. This is the packaging it comes in. And I got it in the shade Espresso. And, well, oh, that's horrible. Espresso. And this can be compared to Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz. So this is the dupe for this. And I'll show pricing and everything on the screen. I believe this was... $10. This was $10. So we're going to go ahead and open that up. So this is what the product looks like. Just micro brow pencil. One side is the product, obviously, and the other one is a spoolie. So we're just going to go ahead and fill in our brows. And my brows are finally done. So as you can see, this is actually a very like nice product. It defines the brows really well. Let me go ahead and do the other one. And look, this is real ghetto, y'all, but I have this big ass mirror because my tiny handheld one broke, so don't even judge me. And this is what my brows are looking like so far. We're gonna go in with the NYX Control Freak Eyebrow Gel. This can be compared honestly to any clear eyebrow gel. I know Anastasia Beverly Hills has one. I think Benefit Brow does as well. And this is what it looks like, kind of just like a mascara tube. And then I'm just gonna set my brows into place. Just like that. Okay, so next we're going in with, y'all, do y'all see this thing in my hair that will not come out? Okay. So next we're gonna go in with the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Full Wear More Than Concealer. All of these products are taped up and it's really getting on my nerves. Well, it's really getting on my nerves. So this is the product. I got this in Caramel 400. 
I'm just gonna put some on the back of my hand like so and then I'm just gonna take a regular concealer brush I did not purchase brushes from the drugstore but elf and wet n wild have really really great affordable brushes like I have a lot of those brushes in my collection so they do have great brushes if you're looking for a more affordable option for brushes and this is the dupe for the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer which is $27 this concealer is $13.49. I really actually like this a lot, actually, so. But this is such a good product. It literally is just like the Tarte Shape Tape. I'm gonna take this brush here and just kind of blend everything out. I typically don't do a lot when it comes to eyeshadow because I really just like dramatic A lashes and I don't know. I'm just really not into the eyeshadow thing right now. So I'm just gonna go in with a brown eyeshadow. A tip for this though, if you wanna save money, you can always use a bronzer. If you don't use a lot of eyeshadow, use a bronzer or like your contour powder and you can just use that as your like brown eyeshadow. lashes I'm going in with are from Eben New York 25 millimeter wonder cat extra large this is what they look like I got these from the beauty supply store not from Ulta but Ulta also has very cheap affordable lashes but the lashes that I got were only $5.99 so I'm just gonna go ahead and apply these lashes I'm just gonna go ahead and take my lash glue and put my lashes Ooh, this glue is sticky this glue is grip bond it's, it got grip for sure Okay, so the lashes are on. And now we're gonna go get into this face. I'm using the NYX Honey Do Me Up Primer. This is a dupe, I don't know how to say the name of the brand, per usual, typical Peyton. I'll put it on the screen, like I said. But I know, I know that the product is $74. And this is a dupe for that. And it's only, actually as a matter of fact, I got it on sale. Typically eight fifty. I got it for four twenty five. Four twenty five. Seventy four dollars. I don't know, but if you ask me, <laughs> that's a pretty damn good dude. So let's take this off. All this wrapping Alta's doing, I don't understand. This is what it looks like, and it comes with like this spatula. So we're just gonna. Woo, this is cold. I'm 
y'all the way this feels is amazing it makes my skin feel so satiny it's satiny to work okay 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 no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> so yes okay okay now we're gonna go in with the foundation so this is the foundation i purchased the maybelline super stay and warm sand but i feel like this might be a tad too light so i'm gonna mix it with my go-to my coconut 355 just to be on the safe side because you know i don't want to be out here looking crazy so we're just gonna pump some of this on the back of our hand I'm thinking about three pumps. Look at this. Oh, see, I knew that was going to happen. I knew that was going to happen. We're just going to take my angled brush. I need to clean my brushes. I can't lie. I cannot lie to y'all. I need to clean them. We're gonna we're gonna talk about the color in a second. We're just gonna keep going. We're gonna keep pushing and hope for the best. All I'm gonna say is though, I just checked it out and in person it doesn't look this orange. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Okay, we're gonna go back in with our concealer. So the L'Oreal. I'm just gonna put some under our. Well, no, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna put some back on the back of my hand. Oh God, that was god awful noise. <laughs> Go back in with my concealer brush and just put some under my eye. I make the weirdest faces when I'm doing my makeup. This whole time I have yet to find my favorite concealer brush. Like I have no clue where it is. Not even concealer brush, blending brush. That's what I meant to say. I'm gonna finish blending this in in a second, but I just wanted to go in with this Milani Make It Last Sunscreen Setting Spray. This is a new product. I'm actually so excited about this. This is $13.99. I was just gonna get the regular Make It Last spray, but they didn't have that. But I think this is pretty cool, especially if you're gonna be out during the day. It has SPF 30, so. We're just gonna go ahead. First of all, it doesn't smell good. It does not. But the regular Make It Last setting spray is just flat. That also burned my nose. I feel like I'm dying. <laughs> that was god awful experience.
I just want to make sure everything is super duper blended. Everything looks super duper good. We're going to go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. This is in the shade Deep 35. And this was $7.99. Sift some of this into the lid. Like that. And then we're gonna go in with this brush. We're just gonna go for it. Next, we're gonna go in with our LA Pro Girl Conceal in espresso again espresso that's a popular shade today i'm just gonna take this wrapping off this is only 4.99 yeah just bleed 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 i'm gonna take this how everything is looking so far looking so far looking so far okay bronzer we're going in with this essence sun club luminous bronzing powder there's a dupe for this one too i will put it on the screen i'm gonna go ahead and go in with this big powder brush blush brush and then we're just gonna go to work And now we're gonna go in with this Milani blush. This <laughs> is a dupe for NARS blush. This is an 05 Luminous Soap. And this brush right here, and we're just gonna tap, tap, tap in. We're gonna go ahead and, I really don't wear blush, so. Ooh. Oh my God, this is so pretty. And I actually don't own the NARS blush, so this is exciting. Do y'all see? how flawless this makeup looks like do y'all see it though because i know y'all hear me talking but do y'all do y'all really see me do you feel me okay <clears throat> and then we're gonna go on with the last <coughs> few products that sunscreen stuff is still really killing me i i breathe it in like i did not expect that because i like the smell of setting spray normally so i normally just you know inhale i want the whole smell in my nose but god damn that was strong Okay, this is the Wet n Wild Highlighting Powder. Oh my god. We're gonna go in with a fan brush. I'm gonna push my hair to the back so we can go ahead and do this part. And we're just gonna go ahead and... Oh, do y'all... Mm -hmm. Do y'all see the glow? Oh my god. This is in Precious Petals. Okay, so this is how we're looking. I think this looks beautiful. But we're just gonna go ahead and top everything off with the lips. So I'm so excited about the lips today. I have a couple different products that I picked up. So I got this. So we're gonna start off with the lip liner, which is not actually a lip liner, it's an eyebrow pencil. Um, this is NYX in dark brown. And this was $4.50. Okay, so we lined our lips and we're gonna go in with NYX Lip Lingerie in Teddy. This was $7. 
And last but not least, I have this NYX Butter Gloss in Fortune Cookie. This was $5. I'm kind of letting this dry while I peel off yet another layer of plastic from this. <clears throat> Let me stop talking shit because now I'm choking. And we're gonna go ahead and spray this again, um, but we know now that it's kind of detrimental to our health. So we're gonna close up our nose, okay? So we'll just try this again. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a great time showing you guys some dupes and some affordable drugstore products that you can check out if you saw any that interests you. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and you subscribe and turn on your post notifications and I will see you all next time. Bye. Bye.